Hello and welcome back to another Inspiration Clan video tutorial. In this lesson, we're going to look at how to change the image size in Adobe Photoshop. So let's jump straight into Photoshop and come up to Image and Image Size. This is going to bring up the Image Size dialog box and we've got all our settings in here. Now, the first thing I want to show you is the Constrain Proportions option. So what you'll see here, if I change this amount, the pixel amount, the width, is automatically going to adjust the height for us. Now, this is going to keep the aspect ratio correct for our image. It's going to constrain the width with the height. Now, if this is unchecked here, you'll see we can change this uh, width and the height freely. So, if I want to change the width, for example, to 1500 and the height to 1000, if I click OK, you're going to see it's distorted our image because it hasn't constrained the proportions of our image. So I'm going to undo that, Command and Control and Z. So if you come up to Image and then Image Size and let's lock this and let's decrease the size to 1000, you'll see it will automatically adjust the height for us. And I'm going to click OK and you'll see our image is reduced in size to a thousand pixels in width and height so it's very uh, you need to understand constrained proportions to make sure you don't distort your images it's always good to have that locked if you're just resizing an image I'm just gonna go ahead and undo that command or control and Z I'm gonna come back up to image and image size and I want to actually look at the measurement so in the drop down here on the right we've got percent pixels inches centimeters millimeters points picas columns so you want to choose your measurement I tend to work in pixels so I normally select pixels but maybe you want to work in percent or centimeters uh, it can be, be good to reduce the size down 50% for example with uh, percent but pixels I usually stick with so you can choose that and adjust accordingly now also you want to take a look at resolution um, if you don't understand resolution or haven't looked into resolution before it's very important when working in Photoshop our resolution is currently set to 72 which is good for images for the web for example but if you were looking for images to print or high quality images then this is going to be need to be up around 300 your resolution so if you change your resolution you can see how much our pixels have increased. So we went from 72 to 300. So you can see how many more pixels there are with a resolution of 3000. That's going to upsample or try to upsample um, our image. So we'll just hold fire and see the result. There you go. And we can see it's dramatic, like dramatically increased the size of our image. So let's zoom right out. You can see it's not done a bad job because the image was high quality anyway. But if you upscale an image like that, you're going to lose quality. So make sure you're working with really high resolution stock images so you resample them down rather than up. So I'm going to go ahead and undo that, Command or Control and Z. So there you go. That is how you adjust the image size in Adobe Photoshop. Thank you very much for joining me in this video. I shall see you in the next one.